With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. A piece of iron of mass 100 gram is kept inside a furnace for a long time. Is put in a calorimeter of water equivalent 10 gram containing 240 gram of water at 20 degrees Celsius. The mixture attains an equilibrium temperature of 60 degrees Celsius. Find the temperature of the furnace and the heat capacity of iron is given as 470 joule per kg per degree Celsius. When iron is kept in the furnace, it attains the temperature say equal to the temperature of furnace. So temperature of iron initially denoted as Ti of iron is equal to temperature of furnace mass of iron M iron is given as 100 grams. The equivalent mass of calorimeter denoted as M cal is equal to 10 gram. The water equivalent of the calorimeter is equal to the amount of water needed to absorb the same amount of heat as that calorimeter does for 1 degree of increase in temperature. If the mass of calorimeter is M and the specific heat capacity of that calorimeter is C, we can equate it to mass of water and the specific heat capacity of water Cw. So this value Mw is the water equivalent here. Since we don't know this value, we use water equivalent for our calculations. And the mass of water is equal to 240 grams. When the hot iron is put inside the calorimeter, its heat energy is given to the water and the calorimeter. Therefore, iron will lose the heat and the calorimeter and the water will gain heat. So, heat lost by iron is equal to Mc delta T for iron. The mass of iron is 100 grams. So, in kilograms it will be 100 upon 1000 kilograms. The heat capacity of iron is 470 joule per kg per degree Celsius. And the temperature difference is initial temperature. Let this be equal to T. So, the initial temperature will be equal to T minus the final temperature is 60 degree Celsius. Now the heat gained by calorimeter by calorimeter and water is equal to 240 grams of water plus the water equivalent of calorimeter equal to 10. Since they are in grams, we need to convert it into kilograms, so dividing by 1000. And the specific heat capacity of water is 4200 joule per kg per degree Celsius. Multiplied by the final temperature is 60 degree Celsius and the initial temperature is 20 degree Celsius. Since in case of calorimeter, heat lost is equal to heat gained. Therefore, the heat lost by iron given as 100 upon 1000 to 470, which is the specific heat capacity of iron, 
to T minus 60 degrees Celsius and it is equal to 250 upon 1000 to 4200 into 60 minus 20 degrees Celsius is 40 degrees Celsius. 1000 and 1000 will be cancelled. We get 470 into T minus 60 degrees Celsius is equal to 2.5 into 4200 into 40. T minus 60 degrees Celsius is equal to 42 into 20. 4200 into 100 2.5 into 40 is 100 so divided by 470 this implies T is equal to 953.62 degrees Celsius Therefore, furnace temperature is equal to 953.62 degrees Celsius. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.